Hey everybody, it's Shelby here at Annette & Company School of Dance, uh, the place that I grew up dancing. And I am today in the Red Room, and so this completes the room tour because I have a video up in all three of the other color rooms. And um, I'm actually here today because I was teaching some classes while I was in town to some of their advanced tap dancers. And I thought I would bring you a tap tutorial, as I like to do, from the studio I grew up at. And what I've done in the past and I'm going to do today is instead of teaching my own material, I am going to teach you something classic that I learned as a kid and that is still being taught today. And it's really great material. So I'm going to teach a four set of eight quick center floor combo that could be thrown into dances, but um, it's been going on for years at the studio and it's a staple of my tap dance education. And I'm gonna teach it as quick as I can since it is a longer combo, but the first and fourth set of eight are the same. So let's get started. And thanks so much to Annette for letting me film and um, post some of her material as I love to do. So thank you so much Annette for having me and let's get started. Okay, so this combination starts with a toe on the right foot, and you're gonna go toe, hop, ball, change. Five, six, here we go. One, two, three. And it's a toe on the right, a hop on the left, ball change, right, left. But it's not a swinging fast ball change, it stays in quarter notes. One, two, three. From there, we're going to do an Irish that crosses in front in swinging eighth notes. To finish it off, we're going to step down. You can make this a, a flat-footed stamp if you want. And we're gonna go seven and we're gonna clap on eight. Now, this set of eight is really important because it's also the fourth set of eight. So once you get this, you already have half of the combo. So again, it sounds like this. Two, half, all change. From there, you're going to do step, cross in front, drop your heel. So be careful that your step across is on your toe only, or else you have nowhere to go from there. So you have step, cross, heel. From here, we're going to do a shuffle, and we're going to leap back. Now, that step is very commonly used to put a pullback in, and I'm going to do that. I'm going to put a switching pullback in to the middle of this. Shuffle, I'm on one foot, switching pullback left to right, and I step behind on the left foot. From there, I'm going to step out of it. So, so far, I've got step, cross, hit, shuffle, and back step, step out of it, and now to finish this one, we have two claps. Steps one and two together. Toe, hop, step, step. My weight is now on my right foot, but I am able to still drop my right heel. So I'm going to go heel on the right, step back behind me. One, two. From there, I go heel, step, push step. So, I turn my body from facing the right corner to the left corner. Heel, step, crush back, step. And I'm back where I started, so I can do that Irish again. Heel, step, push, step, step, Irish, step, step. And then I'm ready to do the fourth set of eight, which is the same as the first. That shuffle, hop, cross, step, happens three different times in this combination. So all together, it goes like this. And that's the whole thing. So rhythmically, this combination swings and it starts one, two, three, four, a five, a six, seven, eight. So a five and a six are swinging eighth notes and everything else are just quarter notes. One, two, three, four, a five, a six, seven, eight. Then you start again. One, two, three, a four and a five, six, seven, eight. So a four and a five becomes a triplet and everything else are still quarter notes. Then you have one, two, a three, four, a five, a six, seven, eight. 
a three, a five, a six are the eighth notes, the swinging eighth notes. And then we finish the same way we started. One, two, three, four, a five, a six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, seven, eight. So I hope you liked this classic center floor combination and thank you again so much to Annette for letting me film and post this and I will see you guys in our next tutorial. So I'll see you then. Bye.